So, Doug, what, what would you like to spend a bit of time looking at today? Well, what I thought I would like to talk about, um, Tim, is, you know, I work really hard mm -hmm. all week. Mm -hmm. Lucky enough to the job. I get to the weekend and I can't enjoy the weekend. Hmm. Hmm. I'm just not enjoying weekends. Mm -hmm. and, and you said just then you're lucky enough to have a job. Absolutely. So do you see that as luck? Yeah, being... these are tough days, aren't they? Hmm. These are days when lots of people don't even have jobs. Uh -huh. So I'm lucky to have the job. So was it down to luck that you got the job? Well, I suppose there's always some luck and an appointment, really. But no, it's, it's more so down to effort and right. hard graft, I think. OK, so you you are where you are now through effort and hmm? yeah. hard graft and stuff. OK. And so Monday to Friday, you're in your job? Working away. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Effort and so on. Lots of effort, yep. hard graft. And then you get to the weekend. I really, I reasonably enjoy work actually. Then I get to what the made weekend. That pop into your head just then. What? What made you say that just now? I reasonably enjoy work. Yeah. Because yeah. I was thinking about the contradiction with the weekends because the weekends, I can't enjoy them. Huh. And it and seems like a contradiction. It, well, it does really because you're working really hard. Yeah. Just keeping up with the pace, hitting targets. It's stressful. Yeah, yeah. I go back home, I can't enjoy it. And so what, I'm not enjoying my time. In what? But I should be resting. Where does the contradiction come in? Well, I think it comes in that you kind of earn your time off. Uh -huh. Right, so. Like your weekend? Yeah. Okay. So if you really do a cracking week's work, you should be able to say, right, now I want to. Uh, I want to go to the, uh, run in the countryside. I want to go to a bike ride. I want to have a game of golf. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I want to actually enjoy the weekend. Because you've earned it. Because you've earned it. Mm -hmm. But in actual fact, I'm too tired or too tense. I think it's more tension, actually. Mm. Too tense. What, what makes you go with tension rather than tiredness? I, I don't think I'm actually fatigued. Mm -hmm. I think it's, it's tension. And as we talk about it just yeah. now, what... What is it that's, what, what are you kind of remembering about, about the weekends that makes you sort of lean towards tension rather than tiredness? Well, I remember that I could have the energy to do something, yeah. but um, I never actually quite get it done. Like, so playing golf, right. I don't know if you're playing golf, but um, I can walk all the way around the course, which is about seven miles. Mm -hmm. I can do all the swinging. Because there's tension, in the body, mm -hmm. I do a bad swing, mm -hmm. I get a bad score, I don't enjoy my round. Hmm. So I think it's more tension. So that's not a tiredness thing, because you... No, I can get round the course. Hmm. 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 Yeah. But not play as well as you'd like to. No, it's, I never get the score I deserve to get. I don't enjoy my weekend the way I deserve to enjoy them. Because you've earned it. Because I've earned it. Hmm. Yeah. And that, you, you mentioned that that was a contradiction. I think it's a contradiction, yeah. Uh -huh. I think if you work hard, you should be allowed your weekend. Hmm. And does the contradiction work both ways as well? Like, like, because you're not enjoying your weekend, does that mean that you're not working hard enough during the week? Um, no, I think I always do pretty good in the work environment. I mean, it's more so the other way around that I'm probably overdoing it during the week. Overdoing it. Which is making me tense in the evenings, knocking my sleep off, and accumulating into the weekend. So it's not, uh, you're kind of saying it's not just a weekend thing, really? No, no, I think thinking about it, it runs through the nights of the week. And uh, What's happening for you now as you think about it? I'm just kind of thinking that one of the ways that it manifests is you end up doing less and less interesting things and you just go down a pub, huh. which is all right. Uh -huh. You're kind of even <laughs> smiling as you say. <laughs> I think it's, it's a funny thing to do because I don't mind going to the pub once or twice, but going to the pub all the time is a bit much, isn't it? And you say it's a funny thing to do. I think it is a bit funny. Well, yeah. What's the, the kind of the funny side of it that you're picking up on? It's just funny that, that someone who is a professional in mental health mm -hmm. doesn't look after their own mental health and ends up going to the pub every night. 
That's yeah, and funny. you're kind of yeah. chuckling as you... Yeah. Well, what do you make of that? I think that's what's happening. And I, I don't think it's what I want to happen. It's it's an accumulation of stressors, I think. Uh huh. So, like, an accumulation during the week? Or yeah. Or what do you mean longer than that? Well, it's probably running back over a number of weeks. And it means you're not... And, of course, the more alcohol you drink, the less well you sleep. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So it looks like a, it's a positive feedback situation, isn't mm-hmm. it? And it's, it's going in the wrong direction. <laughs> so I'm, I'm getting a bit of insight into, into that situation. And so does it accumulate throughout the week till, till say, Friday? Is yeah. That what, yeah. And so we're in about what, Wednesday, Tuesday, Wednesday now. So what yeah. are you anticipating that by tomorrow it'll be a bit, a bit hot? It'll have accumulated a bit more? Yeah, it certainly accumulates through the week. Right. But I'm, I'm not cre- I'm not at my best creative, happiest, spontaneous form hmm. on any of the nights, I don't think. Hmm. So it's How quite do you feel a, about that? Well, I think it's, uh, it's probably gone on too long, really. So probably something needs doing about this, but I can't quite work out it, it's how I've going got on myself into this or how you get yourself out of it hmm. isn't very clear to me. So what, what have you got yourself into? Well, I got myself into working 9 to 5 really hard mm-hmm. and then decompensating for the rest of the time. So the whole thing, you've sort of... I've got myself in that somehow. And you've got yourself in it? I think so. I don't think anyone else is forcing me to do all this work. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And so does it bother you that you do as much work as you do? No, it bothers me that I can't enjoy my weekend. Huh. It's a dilemma. What's going through your mind just now? Well, I'm just kind of... I mean, obviously I do have insight into this, hmm. and yet I'm not prepared to change it. So, so that's what was going through my mind. That, that and is that the insight that you're not prepared to change it? Well, it looks like I'm not prepared to change it. Hmm. And you're that, saying that it is, looks like that's a bit of a block, isn't it? Hmm. So it, it looks like a bit of a like a wall that I need. That the, the image that I got there was actually of a dam hmm. with a whole lot of water behind it. So that's that's what I saw in my mind there. When, and which when side of the that. dam wall are you on? I, I'm in, I'm definitely on this side. Where the water is. No, I'm on the other side. Huh. <laughs> and, and the water's on the other side. It's a huge, great dam, and it's filled up with all this water behind it. Huh. So so that that's the image. I don't know where that came from, but that's what this situation looks like. How to close me. to the wall are you? Um. When I when I, I when I got the image, I was like about. Oh, well, I could look up and see the height of the thing and the water lapping at the top, so I must have been reasonably near yeah, to yeah. the base of this dam. And the, so the water's actually lapping, it's the, there's at that the top, much water in it. Yeah, and some of it was kind of coming over the top. Okay. <laughs> Are there sounds with it as well? Couldn't you? Yeah, there's, there's, there's lapping sounds yeah, at yeah. the top of it. Huh. The dam looks fairly sturdy, but um, I'm not sure it's going to hold. <laughs> <laughs> How do you feel about that? That is a bit of a frightening image. Really? I frightening? Don't, I don't know why I think it's so funny. Huh, huh. Yeah. Does that puzzle you, that it's frightening but you're kind of laughing about it? Yeah, I don't know why I'm laughing about it. Because if, if, it, if it breaks down, then I'm going to get swept away. Huh, huh. Where, where do you see that going? Well, I just saw myself getting swept down a valley. <laughs> With arms and legs up in the air like this, just get swept right away down. And you, you're laughing again. Is yeah. it still a frightening sort of? Um, it's not so bad now that it's broke. Huh. In my mind, you huh. know, now that it broke and it's swept me away, I actually seem to have survived it. Huh. So it's not so bad. Hmm. Well, we leave it just there. Yeah. Huh.